Hey, I'm back again with Madeline, and we are going to do a um, details video. Um, she is the uh, Lotta sculpt by Sigrid Bach, and her sculpts that she makes, she makes these gorgeous girls, and I I don't know, I was just perusing eBay and uh, this little girl popped up and I couldn't help myself. I bid on her and I won her and she got here in two days. It was all wham bam, thank you ma'am. It was very fast. <laughs> but I'm intrigued. Now, when I got her, did her box opening, um, she's she is 31 inches tall for one thing uh, i picked her up and i tell you i have infant babies that weighed more than she did she was so light um she probably weighed maybe three or four pounds and for a 31 inch tall doll that was pretty light i picked her up and almost threw up in the air <laughs> but um anyway um so we did some surgery on her today and I uh, found out why she was so light. She was mostly just fluff. Um, she only had just a little bit of um, um, glass beads in her feet and hands. Um, she did had a little in her torso, um, but that was about it. The rest of her was just fluff, so she was very light. But um, I did her. Um, she's now got, can I have this? Madeline, thank you. She now has glass beads up to like mid thigh and up above her elbows to about right there. Um, I stuffed her body a little bit fuller and tighter so she can now stand up on her own as she sits up nice and straight. Um, I put a little bit of um, weight in her head and uh, I did um, put some rings on her arms, so her arms turned real well, a uh, ring on her head, and but I didn't put rings on her legs because I wanted her legs to be stiff enough that she could stand up, and the rings would have made her <clears throat> legs move too much. Um, she has uh, long red human hair. Uh, with a slight wave to it, which is nice. She's bangs. Um, very pretty brows. And she has these green eyes with a tad of blue around the outside of them. Beautiful pink lips. Uh, a nice shade on her lips. And on her cheeks, she's nice and pink. Um, now, some her hands come together as if she were going to hold a ball or hold on to something. Um, now, something really odd about this is her body. Let's see if I can... She has on a necklace that came with her. It's a cross with pink beads on it. It's really cute. Um, but this is her body. It's not a um, flesh tone body. It's... Um, blue with little uh, white hearts on it and it's got this little uh, sticker here that's got bunnies on it and I asked the lady so to me she said that is uh, a custom for Sigurd's doll so it was a custom body and at first I didn't like it and then I got to thinking she's always going to have clothes on anyway and we always put these little undershirts on them Anyway, so it just looks like she's wearing an undershirt. So, yeah, I'm okay with it. Um, I'm fine with it. <clears throat> she has very pretty... Her nails are done very well. Um, the veining on her is a little too prominent for my liking. But it's okay. It doesn't bother me. Her bangs hide the veins on her head. And it's okay. She, she has a great coloring wonderful coloring nice yeah you know, little modeling and pink on her knees 
Let's stand it up here. Her legs are a little tight, and I did that on purpose so that she would be able to stand. But let's see, are you seeing her? Yeah, she's got these little pink knees. Kind of skinny little legs. And when she stands, she does stand a little um, pigeon-toed. But that's, that's okay. Um, what else can I tell you about it? Oh, she has pierced ears. Which a lot of my toddlers now do. And her hair, I'll show you. It's extremely long. Comes down to her butt. It has a slight wave to it, as you can see. And... Let's see, sit her down again. But she's not jointed, so she when she sits, her legs do kind of go out to the side. But as you can see, oh, her hair is very thick. Are you seeing that? Yeah, it's rooted very thick, very nice. Yeah, and uh. I struggled. I think I told some of y'all this in <clears throat> my comments. Oh, she wears a size four shoe. Um, this shirt that she has on is a 12 months. Uh, and her shorts actually are 18 months. <clears throat> but um, the dress she came in was a 2T, but it was uh, a big honor. Okay, you guys sit up here, Madeline? Okay, so... As I said, her name is Madeline after my great aunt who died way too young. She was in her 40s and she died of a um, cerebral hemorrhage. And so, and she was just so pretty. So I named her Madeline after my aunt Madeline. And I named her middle name Jade because of the beautiful green eyes that she has. So she's Madeline Jade. And um, I, what I said, uh, what I was saying before when I was talking about in some of the comments I told you, some of you, I struggled with how to spell her name. Aunt Madeline's name was <clears throat> M-A-D-E-L-I-N-E, -E, which is, I think, a very common uh, way of spelling it. Uh, and then I thought of M A D. E L Y N, and then what I finally settled on was M A D A L Y N. I think it's kind of pretty <clears throat> spelled that way, so we went with that, and it's a little different. So there she is. This is my sweet little Madeline, and thank you all so much for uh, your welcoming her into the community. She is just. I'm just in love. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I wouldn't mind having another one of Sigrid Box dolls. So you never know. What have you done? Oh, I did this when I was looking at your arm. There you go. There you go. Sweet little girl. So thanks for watching. Thanks for welcoming Madeline to the community. I love you all. I'll see you real soon. Bye bye.